and co-founder of Curlec. Curlec is a fintech company that makes it really easy for businesses of all sizes to collect recurring payments and take control of their cash flow. And how we do this is that we build technology on top of the direct debit bank-to-bank -bank payment infrastructure. So collecting recurring payments in Malaysia has historically been very difficult for businesses, particularly SMEs. Having the ability to truly take control of your cash flow and make sure you get paid on time has never really been an, an option for, for SME businesses. And why is that? Well, firstly, that's due to the lack of adequate payment options out there. And as you can see from the slide behind me, cash, check, bank transfers, credit cards, standing orders, just don't cut it when you want to collect recurring payments. And what we feel is the best payment mechanism for collecting recurring payments, direct debit, whereby a business has the ability to pull payments directly from a customer's bank account following a one-time authorization. This has only ever been available to large corporates that have the capabilities and resources to facilitate it. And why is that? Well, it's all to do with process. And as you can see from the slide behind me, the previous direct debit process, an admin nightmare. I'm not going to try and make any sense of this right now, but what I'm going to tell you about it is that it's a super complicated, paper-based, manual, admin-heavy process that has super long onboarding times and high rejection rates, which acts as a huge barrier to entry to any business trying to use this payment product. So what do we do at Curlect to solve this? Well, we move away from this spaghetti diagram into a very simple three-step process. And now a business can onboard a customer for a direct debit online in a few clicks, within a few minutes, with a 100% success rate. And then when they have that authorization, go and collect payments automatically or seamlessly in the background, and then reconcile this against their accounts with our APIs. So really, end-to-end -end automation for a business, which takes away a lot of their pains when you know, trying to collect payments, as I'm sure one of the judges will know on this panel. So that's a little bit about what we do. Uh, and in terms of our traction so far, our story. So we have been around, we launched the company just under 18 months ago now. And since then, we have processed over 70,000 transactions uh, with a gross value of over 90 million ringgit, close to 100 million ringgit now, which is not bad considering that we started from ground zero in a brand new market, so we're having to create this market, and really, for the majority of these 18 months, had a sales force of just one. So a huge room for growth. And this, to add to this, like I said at the beginning of this presentation, we serve businesses of all sizes, across a wide range of industries, from very small, and from this list you can see, to very large, AXA and Axiata, MNCs, and everywhere in between and for any catcher guys in the audience, sort of a familiar face as well. And just to end this presentation, I've got a bit of time, um, I'm just going to share with you a company in another part of the world that's doing exactly what it is we're doing. Online direct debit payments targeted at SME businesses. And it's a company called GoCardless. Founded in 2011, last year they transacted over 10 billion US dollars, and this year raised a $75 million uh, Series E round led by Google and Salesforce Ventures. And what's particularly interesting about these guys is that they came into a very mature market in the UK, 60,000 merchants, and within a few years acquired a third of the market. So 20,000 out of a 60,000 merchant market. In Malaysia, prior to Curlec, there were only 400. 400 direct debit merchants out of a business population of 1 million. And why is that? That paper process is a nightmare. And now here at Curlec, we solve that. And really, our focus is now growing that number, making sure businesses in Malaysia can really take control of their cash flow. And once we're done here and growing that number, and really you know, taking this to the masses, we're going to take this to the rest of Southeast Asia, because quite frankly, this just does not exist in this part of the world. So thank you very much. Uh, my name is Zach. Ooh. Come and find me later. Come and find me. Thank you. Thank you so much, Sam.